fatwa, why this particular room did not have the same propaganda like any other pieces in the museum. I mean, I stopped over here and I, I love this. And you know, I see today you're wearing a beautiful necklace in gold. But with all my respect, when I compare it with this, it is unbelievable. How many kilos is this? 14 kilos. Oh my God, 14, 14 kilos. kilos of gold. Of gold, absolutely. Not just one, but two. All of them? Yes. Here. We have another one of the same style. Now, this whole discovery, this whole gallery, called the Tanis Gallery, belongs to this king called Psusines, the first. We are now in the Delta. No, wait Tanis. a minute. Now, may I interrupt you? Sure. You just mentioned Tanis. Yes. So I believe the new obelisk that is coming here, and it's just going to be outside. It's exactly. also from that same place. Absolutely. Tanis. Absolutely. Oh my God. But it's a Ramses II uh, uh, well, uh, yeah, obelisk. They're, they're but coming from the same region. Exactly. So why did this collection of, now hear me well, the very only intact tomb ever discovered in Egypt. Meaning, Tutankhamun was an extraordinary discovery yes. of a tomb that may not be intact, that may have been robbed in antiquities. Ancient time, yes. Ancient times. This one was never touched, but nobody heard about it. There what? has to be a reason. 1940 was the discovery. What was happening in the world? Oh, oh, oh the World War II? Exactly. Well, can I ask you a question Please. again? So you're telling me that all this collection, when we open up and everybody come back again, this will be displayed. I and mean, it is beautiful. And that's why when people come, they will get to enjoy everything here that we are bringing to you because we want you to stay home. Stay safe.